Hey, what's up, everybody? Camp has officially begun. Walkthroughs and padded practice is tonight. Actually, right now. So this is serious. I'm excited. I'm pumped. I almost want to cry from excitement. Tears of joy. Football's here, man. We already have a lot of news breaking out of here. The first one out right off the bat, the bum. Joe Randall 2.0, Lucky Whitehead, has officially been cut by the Cowboys. It broke earlier this morning that he was uh, uh, arrested on theft. $40 worth of just, you know, miscellaneous junk. Just stupid and really dumb. Um, Ian Rappaport just broke here just a few minutes ago that the Cowboys have, in fact, just cut Lucky Whitehead. He is no longer on the team. Thank God. Get these guys out of here. This guy wasn't doing anything for us. We got guys here that are going to get it done. All right, this opens the door immediately for other guys here. Andy Jones, Noah Brown. Uh, Ryan Switzer, obviously, is, is almost assured a, a lock here. Um, but that's it, man. Turning the page on this guy here. The team can move on here. They got to... Um, they got to get focused here, and they're this is business, right? This Cowboys mean business. Made the cut here. Not going to tolerate the bull crap anymore. Whitehead's out of here. The other thing I want to touch on, the uh, tempered expectations of Jalen Smith versus the gross exaggerations on him. All right, so this morning and throughout the day, uh, there's clips here of him uh, jogging out. You know, some people are saying there's a limp there and just, you know, just dogging the player. Um, for me, I didn't see a limp. He looked like he was walking out here, you know, like a normal person. If that's a, if he's walking out there jogging like that, then, then I have a limp. <laughs> All right. And then, uh, you know, just a few seconds here of a clip here that Machota had, John Machota. Uh, you know, again, you know, people saying, hey, he's got a limp. He's slow. Why this and that? I mean, come on, man. There, there's just a lot of rush to judgment here on, on what we're seeing here. Um, we got to temper the expectations. The expectations are he's still in recovery. He's probably about 70% right now, if, if we're being totally honest here. 70% player, that's that's where he's at right now. Is he ready to start right now? Probably not. Uh, you know, but, to, but some of these instant armchair gross overreactions are kind of crazy all right i mean you, you gotta temper the expectations still recovering you know they're saying six to nine more months and he'll be at a full recovery so right now you know he's he's out there he's getting his thing done you know he's, he's getting his feet wet that's what we want all right so he, he's with the second team making calls with the second team and um, assignments and that kind of thing so you know they're going with the plan here um i'm going I'm not going with what I'm seeing here in these six-second clips versus what the coaches and guys on the ground are seeing. So um, take a look at some of these clips and um, of him, and you can make a judgment for yourself. And then here's a tweet here from Brian Broaddus as well. Check this out. So that's everything there. Um, you know, and talking about Lucky Whitehead and expectations here for Jalen Smith. Just give it time, all right. Um, you know, some fans want this guy to be instant starter here right off the bat, just looking like a superhero out there. That's just not the case, right? I mean, they're going to bring him along. They said he's going to be brought along limited basis. Um, you know, for all you know, he may start out on NFI. We'll see. But there's no no reason to rush to judgment. You know. And start dogging the player. Support your players. All right. Support these guys, especially these good guys, man. Jalen Smith. This guy's a good guy. High character guy. You want players like this on your team? Support your Cowboys, right? Um, that's all I have to say about the Jalen Smith here. Uh, they know what they're doing. They're, they're going to work him in, and it's just going to take some more time here. Um, in the meantime, the starters here, Hitchens. Playing there at the mic, Sean Lee and Damian Wilson. So that's that's probably going to be your day one starters here. Um, not bad. All right, left guard, Chaz Green, Jonathan Cooper battling out right off the bat. Anthony Brown, like I said here in the other video, covering Dez. Let's get to it. All right, I want to see these two scrap it out. 
um, Orlando Skandrick also uh, alternating with with Anthony Brown. So a lot of news here, a lot of uh, storylines to cover. We're going to do a, um, a report here. Uh, Foots and I, we're going to try to record something here and talk about camp. But uh, that's it for the breaking news here, the big items of the day. That's it, guys. Camp is here. Let me know what you guys think. What, what's your thoughts on Lucky Whitehead? Are you glad to be rid of him? Which wide receivers do you think have more of an opportunity to move up and possibly make the team, right, with his uh, – let me know what you guys think about Jalen Smith and, um, you know, some of the fan reaction that's been hopping around there uh, and that kind of thing. And let me know how you feel about it um, and that sort of thing. But that's it, guys. Thanks for supporting the channel here. We're going to keep it going here. Please like and subscribe to the channel, share, and everything like that. I really appreciate you guys. Make sure you put your comments here in the commentary, and I'll try to get to uh, all you guys on a, as soon as I can. All right? So thanks, guys.